Hi guys, it's Ash with a response to my how to allocate more RAM to your vanilla Minecraft server video because a lot of people have been saying in the comments that they are getting errors when they um, follow, the, follow the tutorial and um, I've looked into that and I think I found a fix for most of you so yeah here it is yeah, let's get started Okay guys, so after someone commented on my video saying that um, the tutorial worked for them after they set Java's environment variables, I decided to look into that and here on Java's website it says that the path is the system variable that your operating system uses to locate native executables from the command line or terminal window. So that means that when you um, run that batch file you are opening up the command line and um, that makes sense because yeah what it says so close that um, and now I'm going to show you how to set your system environment variables because that might be why you're having issues so let's go into um, computer uh, go into system properties Go into advanced system settings, go into environment variables, and look for path. If you don't have that, go ahead and hit new and name it path, and then wait there for now. If not, if you already have this, then hit edit and put your cursor down there. Now let's open up computer again. Go into local disk. And now depending on the version of Windows that you have, um, I have a 64-bit computer. Um, that will be um, what folder that you that you need to look in. So I have a, I also have 64 bit Java. Now if you don't have 64 bit Java, I suggest that you install it. Um, if you don't know what version of Java that you have, go ahead and search in both folders. Whichever one has the Java folder will tell you um, what version of Java you have. If it's in here, it's 32-bit. If it's in here, it's 64-bit. Okay. So let's go in there. Um, open up the Java folder. Go in there. Go in bin. Hit properties. And copy this. Okay. Paste. Um, you want to put a semicolon over there to separate the two. For now, hit backslash. And type in bin too because it did not paste that part in and it didn't copy it either so you don't want to forget about that okay that's important you need the semicolon and the bin at the end hit ok now hit edit again to make sure what you put in there did not get erased All right I hit ok close out of that and you should not be having any more issues for the most part um, if you still have issues I suggest trying um, to open it as an administrator by right clicking and hitting open as administrator or run as administrator um, if you're having issues even after that um, put whatever like in the um, window that pops up it should say some text put that into the comments um, and I'll try to help you as best as I can so yeah that's it for this video guys thank you very much for watching um, if this helped, please do give it a like and try to show anyone else this video. So yeah, that's it, and I'll see you guys later.